Losing's a part of life. You're going to lose somewhere along the way. You can't avoid it. Um, we all lose in the end. Life's one big game. And you've just got to apply yourself every single day to the best of your ability. Of course, I worry about, you know, um, what's going to be this time next year. But the older I'm getting, the more I'm understanding that I can't change what's going to be in a year. All I can do is focus on now. And every day I get up, try and be better than I was yesterday. So, you know, but I'm, I'm also mindful that when you lose, you learn. Because I don't think I've ever learned anything from knocking somebody out or winning a fight. You know, the first fight I had on TV, in Derry Matthews, I got knocked spark out in round 10. I learned a, a huge lesson that night, uh, live on Sky Sports. <laughs> and uh, it was, you know, it was a tough time. When I got beat to Luke Campbell, I was, um, extremely, extremely upset because I was extremely embarrassed. You know, he comes from the west side of the city. I come from the east side of the city. We uh, we all know the same people. And I felt like every time I went out, people was looking at me and laughing at me. And they probably won't. They was probably just looking at me and saying, that, that's Tommy Coyle over there. But in my mind, I was looking and thinking, you know what, people are laughing at me because I got knocked out. I thought, you know what, I'm not done yet. You know, that was a world title eliminator. I'm going to come again. So I got back in training. I refused to lose. I refused to give up. I persevered. And um, I overcome that adversity and I started training for another fight. And there's been many, many nights laid in bed, crying my eyes out. There's been uh, many nights where I've been, you know, dosed up on painkillers. <laughs> um, many nights where you haven't got the look of the draw. Somebody else has got the big fight but you've just got to persevere. How do you have a happy life? You have to chase whatever it is you want and you have to be tunnel visioned and you have to almost accept that you ain't going to get it straight away. Surround yourself with good people, with winners. Find a good woman or a good man if, if that's the way, you know, the way your um, sexuality is. I'm not motivated by financial success. What, what, what I'm motivated by is legacy. I want to leave a legacy. I want people to say, when I'm no longer here, you know what, it wasn't the greatest of fighters, because let's have it right, I'm not. But he was a good kid. You know, I give plenty back to a community, uh, which I'm proud to be from. This community supported me, um, not just in victory, but in defeat as well. And I, I get tremendous amounts of support, and, and for that, you know, I'll go the extra mile for everybody.